Hey, Mom. Hi, honey. How was your day day with your friend? It was fine, but I have a surprise for you. A surprise, like something you made for me at school or something that um, I can't think of anything. What's a surprise? Close your eyes and I'll bring it in. Okay. Did I just hear a dog bark? Well, see for yourself. Open your eyes. Oh, what an adorable dog. Isn't he adorable? Yes. Get him out of here. Mom, He's he followed me home. A dog followed you home? We live in the city. How could the dog have followed you home? He just did. Okay, um, Heather. Can I keep him? Honey, we don't even know if he belongs to anybody. Does he have tags? Yeah, but that doesn't mean anything. Uh, we better make some lost dog posters. But Mom, the dog obviously followed me home, obviously, because his, his owner didn't want him. Honey, if he was, if this dog was your dog, wouldn't you want him back? Maybe. I think you would. Come on, help me make some signs. But I love Bullet. Bullet? That's what it says on his name tag. Bullet. And I want to keep him. Please, Mom? Honey, maybe someday you can have a pet. But right now, but this dog isn't ours. It's not fair. I really, I really want to keep Bullet. Well, I'm sorry, honey, but we don't always get what we want. Fine, make the lost dog posters, but don't expect me to help. Heather! Don't worry, Bullet. No one's gonna take you away from me. You're such a sweet dog. <laughs> Man. Hi. Hey. Listen, I was hoping you'd calm down by now. I guess I'm a little calmer. What is it? Well, I placed it a flyer on the internet, um, telling people that we found Bullet, gave a, gave, sent out our name and address, and we got a response right away. What do you mean you got a response right away? He belongs to one of your classmates. Who? Um, her name is Mindy. Mindy? I'm not giving her the bullet back to Mindy. Heather, why not? Because Mindy and I don't get along, and she doesn't deserve this dog. This dog followed me home. Obviously, Mindy wasn't taking very good care of him. I already found a couple of ticks in here. Listen, I don't... Ticks? I hope there's none on the floor. No, I was smart enough to kill them with alcohol and to throw them away. See, I'm more responsible than Mindy is. Heather, look, I know this is hard on you. And I know how much you love Bullet, but think how Mindy feels. I don't want to think how Mindy feels. She doesn't deserve this dog. She doesn't take care of him. Honey, like I said before, if Bullet was your dog and you lost him, I'm sure you would want him back. That's different. I actually took care of him. You've only had the dog for 15 minutes. But he, I love Bullet and he loves me. I understand that. But Bullet belongs to somebody else. I'm sorry, honey, but you, you have to give him up. I don't want to. I want to keep him, Mom. I'll take good care of him, I promise. Honey, I know you would take care of him. But... Mi Bullet is not our dog, it's Mindy's. And she's coming over in a few minutes to pick him up. Fine. But she's coming in here to get him so I can talk to her. I expect you to respect her. I will. You're doing the right thing. If it's the right thing, why do I feel so lousy about it? Because you love Bullet. And I'm 
sorry that you can't keep him, but you're doing the right thing. I'm going to give Mindy a call and tell her to come over. Okay? Yeah. Oh, bullet. <laughs> Heather, Mindy's here to pick up her dog. Okay, send her in here. You can come in. Hi, Heather. Bullet, come here. Why did you run away? How did he run away? I don't know. I was at the park and he was chasing a squirrel and then next thing I knew he was gone. Why didn't you keep him on a leash? Well, he usually doesn't need the leash. He usually stays with me. But I should have kept him on a leash so he wouldn't get lost. Yeah, you should have. And I found ticks in him. I know, I was going to take him to the vet that day. That's where we were heading when, when I lost him to the vet so he can get his ticks taken out and get some medicine for him. So you do take care of the dog. Of course I do. What did you think? That I didn't take care of him? Why do you think I got tags on him? Yeah. Whatever. I may not like you very much, but I guess you do deserve this dog. Thanks. I don't like you that much either, but I appreciate you taking care of him while you had him. Of course, I love dogs. You know, if we become friends, I'll let you visit Bullet anytime you want. Really? Yeah, he seems to really like you. He does. Look, since we're going to be starting junior high next year, I think it's time we put our differences aside. And I'll let you play with Bullet anytime you want. Just not at 3 in the morning or anything like that. I need my sleep. <laughs> really? Really. I really appreciate you returning him. I know it was hard to do. I mean, who could blame you? He's a great dog. Go on, you bullet. <laughs> yeah, he is a great dog. Well, look, I better get him home before my mom gets too worried. Um, but I'll, I'll message you on Facebook, okay? Okay. Okay. Come on, bullet. Bye. Bye. Bye, Mindy. Bye. Hey, you okay? Yeah, I guess so. Mindy said I could visit Bullet anytime I wanted. Yeah, that's good. I know it stings that you had to give the dog back, but I'm very proud of you. Yeah. Can I get my own dog someday? Someday. I'm proud of you. Thanks, Mom.